Built in 1927, the Palastra is often called the Cathedral of College Basketball. Many prominent players and historic moments have happened in the arena over the years, and Lafayette's head coach, Fran O'Hanlon, has been able to experience some of those moments. You know, I love coming back here. I, I played here in high school. This is where I first started watching basketball at the Palestra, uh, back when I was in grade school. I mean, this is, this is the cathedral of college basketball. The Leopards traveled to West Philadelphia this past Wednesday, where they took on the University of Pennsylvania. The Leopards entered the game coming off of a victory over St. Francis, Brooklyn. But Lafayette had a hard time finding the bottom of the bucket. Well, we kind of let the game get away from us. We uh, cut it to two, which I thought we had a great comeback, and then we kind of lost our poise. We missed a layup. We uh, threw the ball way out of, underneath our own basket a couple times where they laid it back up. And they go off a 10, uh, they go on a, you know, 10 nothing run, which really killed us. We don't have the uh, capability right now of coming back from that kind of deficit starting in the second half. We didn't come out to compete. We didn't come out of the gate strong. We got in the gas. We didn't really create for our shooters. We got to really concentrate on that one moving forward. With Lindner being the only active senior on the team, the Leopards are looking at Paulus Jalis and Kyle Stout to step up on the court. This is the potential learning experience from them, for them. And, um, you know, I, they competed at times, but we're, we need to be more consistent. They need to, consi they can, need to consistently compete on every possession because in college basketball you can't let down, you know, you can't lose your poise, you got to execute uh, for 40 minutes to have a chance to play in, in, against a team like this in this environment. So uh, hopefully we will get better and be more consistent as, as we continue to progress. But despite the loss, Lafayette can still learn from this experience playing in the historic Palestra. If they don't like this, if they don't get a kick out of playing here, then they'll never get a kick out of playing anywhere. This is, this is as good as you're going to find. I think when they came in here, the young guys were, they were very impressed with, uh, with it. Uh, there's such tremendous history here that um, it's, I don't know if there's any other place. I know I'm biased, the best place for college basketball in America. Um, it's an amazing experience, uh, a historic venue, obviously. It's a great experience, but I would much rather win. <laughs> the Leopards return home to take on Sacred Heart this Sunday at 2 p.m. Reporting from the Lafayette Sports Network, I'm Isabella Walco.